all right I don't know how I did it but somehow I did I just soloed Osmo with the Garnet without the aid of friendly monsters it wasn't easy I think I died like 30 times before I did it only thing now is I gotta prove it because uh, this is one of those things that absolutely nobody nobody nobody's going to believe until they actually see it with their own two eyes and trust me I, I didn't think it was possible at first but it just requires a lot of luck it requires a, a, a little bit of skill and a lot of luck but like I said now I, I gotta prove it I, I, I should have recorded it when I did it but now that I'm recording it it's never gonna happen of course but we're gonna try aren't we anyway where's the best of the day let's see uh, he's right in front of me is he yep there he goes in order for me to pull this off without the aid of freedom most anyway is um, I, I need I need a few things to happen the first thing I need to happen is I need him to uh, I need his first turn to be doomsday or if his first turn is flare star I need for it to miss and then I can continue if those things uh, don't happen then I reset and I try again because if those don't happen then I'm then I, I've already messed up and by the way uh, you want uh, is that man? Wait, Kupo, there's a terrible monster back there. He'll kill you, Kupo. I can take him. Anyway, uh, by the way, make sure that Garnet's uh, chance gauge is like almost full. The very, very next hit needs to fill her gauge, which is why I need Doomsday or Flesh to miss. Alright, no telling how many times I'm gonna die before I actually do this again, so uh, here we go. <laughs> Fuck this monster, man. This this monster is just unfair. I had him. I had his ass. I fucking had him. I had to hit him one more time at full power for 9,999, and he started using Cure Roger. That's just not. I just had to hit him one more time. But before I had a chance to do that, he started counterattacking with Cure Roger. That cheap son of a bitch. Fuck this monster. I mean, I swear, he used Kiraja over and over and over and over and over again. Then he started mini me to reduce damage due to him. Then he hit me with Meteor, using up my auto life, and eventually he used it again and wiped me out. This this, this monster is just not fair, all because of the counterattack Kiraja. That's the only thing that makes this guy hard. Counterattack Kiraja is the only reason why Ozma is the hardest boss in Final Fantasy. Yes. This guy is the hardest boss in Final Fantasy because of that and because of that cheap ass meteor. Alright, your first turn is going to be. Flesh Star. Oh, Doomsday. That's okay. I need for that to happen. Bahamut, let's go. I'm gonna use my my calculator on my computer so I can keep keep track of how much damage I've done to him so I get some kind of idea when the son of a bitch is gonna die. <laughs> Now he's gonna do curse. And if that thing goes according to the plan, it should trance me without meaning me. Since that attack put me in chance form, I don't get minted on that turn. But unfortunately, sometimes that it will minute you without filling your trance gauge, which is really, really, really cheap. Alright, this is another hit for 9,999, so he's taking about 20,000 damage after the free Bahamut summon. So so far, we're doing so good. Now, at this point, I need him to I, I need him to favor um, 
At this point, I need him to favor Flare Star over Doomsday and Meteor, of course. Now, he can use Doomsday a few times, but I can't have him using it all the time. Because if he does it all the time, then I'll never get to hit points. I need him to favor Flare Star over the other two. So that's a 33% chance. Since he's going to use Death and Flare. And hold it because I'm not, you know, affected by that. Here we have Berserk. That's a counter attack. Okay. Now he's, he's on his Meteor turn. Let's hope he doesn't use Meteor. Or Doomsday. Oh, fuck, 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 fuck! Uh, please survive this. Damn it, I didn't survive. That's okay. I'll be given another chance. Alright. He's back on his curse turn now. Meeting me, unfortunately. That, that fucking meteor just... I can't tell you how much I hate that shit. Five thousand, not bad for for you know a uh, uh, mini. All right, he's taking about twenty-five thousand. Let's have his health. Now let's see. What turn is this? Is he gonna do curse or meter? I forgot where he was because that bitch downstairs is banging on my wall again. Let's see here. Was it? I think I'll cast Bahamut here. I probably should have wait to see what his what his normal turn is gonna be. Damn, I hate Meteor, man. That really slowed me down. That Meteor just really fucked me up. Flare Star? Okay, that's good. That's good. That's good. Alright, now I'm gonna do about another 5,000 damage to him. From a, from a minied Bahamut. I wish I was my full size, but the fucking curse just... <sighs> yeah, I like... All I can say is you pretty much just need luck and lots of it. If you plan on soloing this guy with, with uh, Garnet in any form, friend of the monsters or no, you need luck to do this shit. Lots of it. 99% luck, 1% skills. Three hundred, not bad. Okay, he's lost about thirty thousand hit points. So at this point, he's going to start counterattacking with the uh, Kiraja. I'm hoping his next turn is going to be fucking cursed, because if that happens, I'll be at full. I'll be at a full body, and then I can do a nine thousand summon from behind me. Curse. All right, good, good, good. I'm at full health now. If he doesn't use Kiraja or Spare Meteor, I should kill him. I'm gonna do uh, 9,000 to him. So he would have taken 40,000 damage. Let me see. But I gotta keep track with, with uh, him, him healing, his, healing his hit points. Okay, he's taking about 41,000. So if I hit him two more times, I should be out of this mess, finally. Because I've actually been at this for about three hours trying to actually record me beating him with Garnet without the aid of Friendly Muscles. Because I don't think anyone has dared to uh, try this. It's, 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 pretty, it's pretty fucking gutsy. It's, it's pretty gutsy. Alright, what we got now? 
Mega Flare. He's probably gonna start using Karaja now, so instead of uh, getting my my remedy ready, I'm gonna start spamming Bahamut again. But he's on his meteor turn, so my chances of dying here are very, very. And there's there's that fucking shit Karaja. I hate this fucking spell. Nine three hundred. He's on his meter turn, so I'm, 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 I'm probably fucked here. Doomsday. Now, normally this wouldn't be a bad thing, but thing is, he's gonna hear from it again. So I'm gonna attack him on this turn. So this is kind of like a stalemate. This is basically a free turn here. That's what this is. This is a free turn because he's gonna heal not nine thousand nine hundred ninety nine. And that's exactly how much I'm gonna do to him now. So, so this is a free turn. But what's gonna happen is, eventually I'm gonna run out of magic points, or he's gonna eventually keep counterattacking with Karaja and get to his meteor, and I'm just, I'm just never gonna win. I mean, I, I use I usually do fine. Until I get him like almost dead when he starts counterattacking with Karaja, and then I just can't kill him because I just can't get to hit points. I, I don't know what the fuck Square was thinking when they made this guy counterattack half the time with Karaja and spam Meteor. That just wasn't fair for, for, for them to make him do that. That was not fair. I'm sorry. That was really, really cheap and despicable of them. To make this son of a bitch counterattack with the Karaja, that, that that shit was fucked up. Oh boy, here we go again. Six to five hundred. That's not bad. That's actually a side lead because he didn't heal too much. But he's still healing. I gotta notify that damage and then do some more. But eventually I'm gonna run out of magic points or he's gonna use Meteor. Or Curse, meaning in you, reducing the damage you do to him. <sighs> See, I, I should have killed him by now, but he, 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 every time I get ready to kill him, he fucking uses Kiraja. I can't stand that. Now I'm only doing half damage because I'm mini. Let me just go ahead and uh, hear my magic points. Garaja. Oh shit. Somehow I survived, okay. I'm not dead yet. I've been given a second chance in life. Yeah, if, if he does Meteor and you survive it, consider yourself extremely lucky. Because that that one attack is the only reason why this, this boss is hard. Because if he does that, then you're probably gonna lose. Now I should be cursed, right? Yeah, but my chance is gone. My chance is going, so that's that, that, that's very bad. But actually, that's very good because um, I, that free Bahamut sometimes he counters it with um. Fuck! Why are you doing this? Sometimes he counters that that free Bahamut with um with Karaja. See the 500? Not bad. Not too bad, but I still wish he wouldn't do this. And I'm mini. He, he he. I'm still. I would use a remedy to heal the mini. But I know that if I do that, he's gonna mini me again. So I rather I rather just attack him to keep his hit points in check, 
and wait for him to do curse to put him back in full health and, and, then, and then I get a full a full power behind it. I'm keeping track of his uh, hit points. Between all the healing and the damage I'm doing, let me see, 50 to 65, I've done about 30,000 damage to him. So he, he's got about 2,500 left. Okay, now this is a free turn. So I'm going to do another 5,000 to him. If I'd had my full bodyguard there, I probably would have beaten him. But I'm still hanging in there. Good thing I did that at least when I did. Okay, after this, I would have done about 3,500 to him. I can't believe how hard this monster is. But I said that I was going to solo this son of a bitch with Garnet without the Freedom Muscles and I would not end this LP until I do that. 4900, that's it. That was a weak hit. And here you go again with the fucking Kirajas. 9000 heal. Fuck you, man. And I just lost track of his, his uh, hit points. I fucked up on my computer, so I don't know where his hit points are now. That's very, very bad. At least I'm gonna do some. At least I'm gonna do nine thousand. Let me see. He was at what thirty thousand. Then I did forty nine hundred, and then he healed for nine thousand. And now I'm attacking him again for nine thousand. So I think he's at the thirty five hundred mark. I think I've done a total of 3,500 to him now. After all the healing, I'm 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 not sure. Haven't used my dark matter yet. I'm saving that. I'm saving that for a killing blow. For when I'm like mini, then he's got like one hit left. That's Kiraja. I'm saving my uh my dark matter for a um for a killing blow when he's when I'm like mini and I need like one hit to kill him. God damn it! He's gonna heal from that. Okay, I, I've totally fucked up on, on my calculator here, so I, I have no idea where his uh his hit points are. But they're pretty high now because he, he he just keeps healing over and over and over again. He's just not gonna let me kill him with the garnet bomb. He he's, he's just not gonna let me record this. I don't know where he is on the hit points. He keeps healing. And I fucked up my calculator. He's healing again. Seven thousand that time, but still, he don't heal so he don't heal so much that he's got he's got a lot of health. He's got a lot of health now. Curse, of course. I knew that was coming. Why didn't I use a remedy when I knew he was gonna do that? I knew he was gonna do that shit. But he don't he don't heal so much, I'm trying to keep his hit points low. That's why I'm attacking instead of using the memory. Another unfair thing about this son of a bitch is the way he attacks. Unfortunately, I've been told that any action you take automatically fills up his uh his uh at the time bar. That shit's not fair. He was designed to go first before you do anything. That that shit, that's, that's actually probably the most unfair thing about this monster. That he always gets a, gets a turn before you do. And somehow I survived Meteor again. I'm really blessed here. Mega Flare. Now I need his next turn to be cursed. So I can go back to full, back to full body and um, do 9,000. 
and then I need for him to to not use not use a uh, meteor or dunes I need him to use flare star or use meteor and I survive it which isn't gonna which probably isn't gonna happen to my luck I usually get unlucky breaks when I've got like one hit left to kill the son of a bitch and it's unfair that I'm doing all my damage to him while I'm minied anytime anytime I'm at full body I, I just can't damage the son of a bitch and there he goes counter with the Karaja again Ugh, I hate this son of a bitch man that was his normal turn which means he skipped curse so he's back on his, on his media turn now, but I'm low on magic points, so I got I gotta toss another remedy. Actually, I might not have to. With little luck, I won't have to. I'm, I'm still mini though. He, he he's not gonna. It's like he doesn't want to curse me while I'm mini. This monster has a brain. Karaja counter attack. Let's start. Now see, if, if I had my full body, I would have killed him with that fucking mini and he missed him. See, he just, he just taunted me now. I would have killed him for sure if I had my full body. Just unlucky breaks here. Just unlucky breaks that he's just that I'm minied, and I'm and I and I, I'm doing I'm doing all my summons while I'm mini. That, just just really unlucky break here. Karaja, curse. I can't summon Bahamut this turn because I don't have enough points to do that, and I'm at full body. Now watch his next attack be either Doomsday or Meteor. I wish I could have summoned there, man. Damn. Maybe if I had half a B calls, that wouldn't have been a problem. Doomsday, he's gonna hear from that. That's okay, we're just gonna reset that damage with another 9,000, so this is still mate. Now, I'm assuming he's gonna do a curse this turn, so I'm gonna get my remedy ready so I can attack him with the full body and possibly kill this son of a bitch. Okay, now this is his curse turn, I think. If I trance, that'll be nice, but I don't think I'm gonna survive that long. One of us is not gonna survive that long. There's Kiraja. Cheap asshole! Let me get a uh, remedy ready. 7,000? Not bad, but I wish he wouldn't do that. Curse, there it is. I knew he was gonna do that. I wanna attack this guy with a full body. Because every time I attack him, he counterattacks. Eventually, he won't counterattack, and I'll kill him. But now he's back on his meteor turn. Let's hope he doesn't use it. Let's stop, please. Fuck it's meteor. Me and my big fat fucking mouth. I survived. Six hundred damage. Look at that. That that shit is just random. If if that happens, consider yourself extremely extremely fucking blessed. Because that attack is the only reason why this boss is hard. And here I go uh, repeating myself. <laughs> I think his hit points are pretty low now. If I hit him a few more times, I should beat him. But I wanna, I wanna do it at a, I wanna do it with a full body. Counter-attack Kiraja, of course. 
He's probably gonna do curse now. So let me get uh, dark matter ready so I can do some full damage to him. Oh, if I'd known that, that was his normal turn. If I'd known that, I'd have did a summon. Flesh star. Oh my god! I think I won! I think I just won! I might have won! DK, the best. <laughs> I wish I was the best, but there are some people better than me, sadly. It'll be so awesome to get a victory here with that message online, with, with, with that message popped up. Because this will be the ultimate Final Fantasy IX victory. Solo Ozma with Garnet without the Finland Muscles. I don't think that this has been uh, posted on YouTube before. I think I just won. Please tell me I won. 9,000. Please die. No, he's not dead yet. Damn. Curse. Give me something behind it again. I thought he was dead, but he's not. He keeps, he keeps fucking healing. I can't get this fucking hit points. She's minied, but I was hoping to get the victory pose at a, at a full body, but it looks like I'm going to have to settle for a mini form. I did it! Woo! I fucking did it! I soloed Ozma with Garnet without the friendly monsters. Oh my god! Oh my god! Unfortunately, Hevita Pose is mini. But that's okay. Well, that was a very long, long battle. So there you have it. Ozma soloed by Garnet without the friendly monsters. It can be done. Whew. I can't believe I did that. Well guys, I think that's going to wrap up this LP. It's been really, really fun. I really, really enjoyed playing Final Fantasy IX. And I hope you enjoyed watching this LP. Let's get back to Final Fantasy V events. See you guys later. Take it easy.